Hi, I'm Pamela Tamez from the Haldar Lab at the University of Notre Dame. I'm a biologist specializing in malaria research within the Center for Rare and Neglected Diseases. Recently, I traveled to King Edward Memorial Hospital in Mumbai, the largest city in India. Within KEM, we worked with colleagues at the National Institute of Immunohematology. They specialize in blood disease research. Here's the view from their offices and labs. Malaria, beaten back to almost non-existent levels in the 20th century, has recently made a startling comeback. According to the AFP Newswire, the first six months of 2010 saw more than 14,000 cases of malaria in Mumbai, and this has left hospitals struggling to cope. Out of 5,000 blood samples received daily in city hospitals, almost 300 are diagnosed with malaria. My work involved teaching my Indian colleagues how to grow red blood cells using adult stem cells. They can then use these cells in their research in blood diseases. In return, the Center for Rare and Neglected Diseases here at Notre Dame will have access to new field strains of malaria parasites. Here's Vaishali thawing out adult stem cells using sterile technique. We also have to count the number of cells that we get after thawing. And here Maya is uh, looking at the cells under the microscope. This is what the cells should look like. You see a nice big pink nucleus surrounded by blue cytoplasm. These are the women that will carry on the work, Maya, Kushnama, and Vaishali. And here I am with Dr. Roshan Kola and Dr. Ghosh, who's the director of the National Institute of Immunohematology. By the end of the week, we set a strong foundation for continuing a long-term collaboration. <laughs>